Hi everyone, this is Donna from Hollywood, California. It's not just paint, it's art by Donna. And I'm going to give you a short version of the live I did this it's week quite a while since I've for been live. Hi everyone. the bubble Donna machine from, from Let's Hollywood, Resin. California. And I thought um, I would shorten it up for you and give you the results of the so pumpkin I, I made so and the little the skulls I made at the Thank end Byron, so please Raul, sit back Marie Louise, enjoy uh, it you, um, if you want the long version I Thank will link everybody. it at the end I really appreciate and after it. this please enjoy I shoot craft the kids club <laughs> so, you're gonna really I enjoy am. her video and, uh, first mix up some resin being that we're gonna try out this machine live so first I used the auto resin mixer it's a hand-free uh, resin mixer from Let's Resin. And this was the one I used, I bought last year. Um, I replaced the paddles with this new paddle that I'm showing you here. And I'm going to be mixing 12 ounces of resin with this paddle. I use the Let's Resin epoxy resin high gloss crystal clear self leveling resin now this uses the big cup from let's resin and you just put this on top of the cup you press the button and 43 seconds later your resin is mixed they do have an upgraded version and in the upgraded version, you do get the two paddles that I showed in the beginning. And the, with the upgrade, you do get a silicone cup rather than the cup that I am showing you in this video, which is plastic. Here's the resin that I'm using, and it's the crystal clear. And it really does come crystal clear. There we go. Now, uh, when Ready you use these, um, when you use this resin mixer, if you read their directions, they suggest you let it sit for eight minutes. And they say that your bubbles will disappear. Well, I use this mixer and I use the bubble machine. And you're gonna see that um, in a little bit. The names you see below are all those lovely people and supporters who were at my live on Thursday. Thank you, each and every one of you. That goes 12 ounces. So we have six ounces of part A and six ounces of part B. That's the button. And that's what So you have the button on top. Boy, did I earn that today. <laughs> so here we go. Can you see that? Thank you so much, Lena. I, <laughs> you're laughing, Betty. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Hiya, girl. Get that out. Hi, Tanya. Hi, Anita. I'm sorry if I didn't say hello. Well, uh, well, is that really done? That's how fast. This is Let's Resin. This is a. It's from Let's Resin. I think I have it. I had. To, I. This is the old one. I have the old one. Um, and I think there's a new one out. I bought this last year. Um. I'm just gonna take here. You can see, okay. So now they said that these are easy to clean with some alcohol. And just spray some alcohol. And let's see. 
Normally I would use a baby wipe, but right now I'm just using a paper towel. Yeah, and it is coming right off. I mean, some people say you could let this dry on there. I don't like to let anything dry, personally. Because it's always a pain in the neck to start peeling that stuff off. So I just gave this a few little stirs um, after the mixing machine. And now I'm ready to use the bubble machine. Uh, someone asked how long the working time was with the resin. And I did take out the di directions for the epoxy resin and the working time for this resin was 40 to 50 minutes demolding time was 8 to 24 hours fully cured in two to three days you can see that written right here i did separate the resin into two cups This way it makes it easier for the bubble machine to get rid of the bubbles. But I'm showing you here how the one large cup does fit into this bubble machine without a problem. I'm also showing you as we come upon it how there is a silicon mat on the bottom of this bubble machine. That will help keep your cups in place. And there's no bouncing around when you put the bubble machine on. And you will see that and you will hear that very shortly. And yeah, I'll make it so you can see that. <clears throat> and it's at zero, zero. Now I'm gonna put this top back on. What a haphazard way to do a video. I'll figure this out, but here we go. So when, when you put that on, it seals it. It's already sealed now. Now, when you press the button, it goes to the five minutes automatically. Now the pressure is gonna go up to I think it goes up to 99. Five minutes is automatic. That's how it starts out. Now, do you hear the sound? It's really not loud. And nothing is moving around as you can see. I had another machine before. Um, I had to return it. It was, it was a little loud. And it didn't work for me. Let's just put it that way. It didn't work for me. Well, you can hear there is a sound. Yeah. And it's going to take a while for it to, to reach the 99. You'll see that. Hiya, Kristen. Oh, you don't have your sounds on. That's why <laughs> I do. So I did want to do this in real time. I figured this is the best way, especially when it's live. You can see, you can see for yourself. Right. So here's all the bubbles. There's all the bubbles. And as you watch, see it goes up to 99.9. And we have three minutes left.
I have links down below to um, Pouring Your Heart Out. She did a great review. Um, so did Daniel Cooper, um, Mini Scenes GB. There's lots of people out there that did great reviews on this. Um, so please uh, take a moment. Okay, Kim, thank you. Thank you for being here, Kim. And have a great meeting. Have a great meeting. Um, so if you can see the bubbles, you can see that they're, if you can see how they're kind of separating. I don't know if you can see that. It's like they're getting bigger. And if they're rising, I don't know if you can see that. They're rising to the top. And the bottom is getting clearer. They're getting bigger. 40 bubbles on the top. So we have a minute and 20 seconds left. So as, as the minutes are going down, you don't want to let it reach. See, look at that, that one cup, it's almost uh, done. But you don't want to let it reach the, the zero mark because then the pressure has to go back again. So what you do is, as it gets close, you can add like another minute onto your, um, onto this. So you just watch, I mean, I, while I was using this, I was watching it. Linda, thank you for answering, answering these questions because you probably know a lot more than I do. Um, so now it, it's only got 28 seconds left and I still have, uh, I have bubbles in there. So I'm gonna hit this one more time. And that was a mistake on my part. I should have touched the dial. I should have turned the dial instead of pushing that button in. When you push the button in, that is for when you are watching um, your, your resin and you think it's gonna overflow. That's when you would push that button in and that would stop the pressure from going up and it would push the pressure down. But this is what I'm thinking. Um, if you understand what I'm saying. So since this video was uh, went live last Thursday, I did get the coupon codes for this machine. And you will find them linked down below in my description. So just click on that link below and that will take you to Amazon with the discounted price. So, so far I added the extra, I, I turned the dial, I added the extra minute um, and the bubbles are still going here. Right, Prime Day, that's what it is, Kristen. Prime Day, now there's 20 seconds. I'm gonna hit this to go one more minute because I still have bubbles there. Yeah, so I made it another minute. So five, six, so, so far I have seven minutes in. So I have seven minutes so far. And so far it's taken me about seven minutes to do this process. And you can see, I mean, one of the cups, this cup on the right has so many less bubbles than the one on the left. <laughs> Linda, I wouldn't buy anything now if, if um, you have mixes. Whoops. So I wasn't paying attention and I let the pressure run out. Um, so I, I can let this... <laughs> Yeah, 
so this is my this is my own fault. I could let this go up again. Um, yeah, that was my fault. So because the pressure ran out, I did let it run another five minutes, and I'm speeding through this. Um, I do apologize for the uh, <laughs> for the speed and for the jumpiness of this. Um, but look at those bubbles rise in 20 times motion. <laughs> Uh, and all the bubbles did come out this second time around. Um, yeah, here we go. And as soon as it decompresses, you can hear the sound. But to me now, this is really crystal clear. If you can see that. And it was well worth it to wait and all the pressure is out and now I can take this off Lift this that you don't knock your resin over um, I would be I'm gonna be very careful so I dry brushed this pumpkin with let's resin teal and let's resin plum on the inside and the top of that pumpkin was Let's Resin Olive and Let's Resin Gold. And those were the chameleon powders. Now on these little skeletons on the side, I used the glow-in-the-dark glitter. And I had those prepared already. And I just put some of the resin in there and quickly mix them and put them inside those skull heads okay i did it i did it i made it through and i thank you whoever's still with me thank you linda thank you Aishu, betty thank you thank you thank you jane bonnie Julie E, Tara, thank you. Oh, we did it. Joyce, thank you. Thank you very much. I can't believe I finished. And I only have, look at that, I did it. Pretty good, not so bad. Not so bad, we only have a little bit. There was really no resin left. There was nothing really left here. I just have these little pieces. Madeline, thank you for staying. I didn't forget you, Byron. No, I didn't forget you. I'm just trying to stick the last little pieces of resin in, into that last skeleton head. I hate to... Oh, I have a little drop here that we could use. I'm really excited, Bonnie. Thank you. I'm so excited. I am so excited. Look, I, I, oh, there we go. I got it in that last little, that last little bit. That's it. I finished. I did it. I did it. I did it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven skeleton heads, a pumpkin, and a pumpkin. I hope the pumpkin comes out nice. Byron, I used the teal color. I thought of, of uh, Cinderella when I was doing the pumpkin. I'm so excited. But the resin machine, as you saw, it did take, so it, I did it twice, um, and it worked. I mean, it did come crystal clear. So it took a little longer, maybe because I had extra resin, but I think maybe if I would have put that into three cups, it would have it would have worked. I'm happy you woke up early today, too. And you can charge this up. Oh, you can come visit me anytime with Betty. your let's I will resin. not lock my door. Allison, <laughs> Allison, you have a great vacation. We were in Hawaii a few years ago. We loved it. We had such a great time. I appreciate every Linda, thank you so much. So hope to see you Sunday. It's me and then it's Aishu. So thank you everyone. I really appreciate you from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. There's my door. <laughs> Alright. Talk to you later. So here are my skeleton heads. What do you think about them? And this is the end of my video. What do you think about shortening that live and making it into something 
maybe a little condensed if you don't have the time for that long video. Something we can sit with over a cup of coffee on a Sunday morning. Here is that wonderful bubble machine uh, remover and my little uh, mixer here. Uh, let me know what you think about those and I do have them down below with the coupon codes uh, for your pleasure. Here's my beautiful pumpkin. I really love the way it came out. Please, if you haven't subscribed yet, take a moment and subscribe now. This is Donna from Hollywood, California, signing off with love, light, peace, harmony, and oneness. Thank you all for coming. I really appreciate it. I Should Crafty Kids Club will be following me right now. Wait for the redirect or click on the link.